अजानुलम्बित भुज कनका संकीर्तन कपितर कमलायथाक्ष विशाबरो द्विजरो जुगधर्म पालो वंदे जगत प्रिय करो करुणाभतारो हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे नमा गंगे तब पाद पंकज सुरासुरबंदित दिव्य रूप भुक्ति मुक्ति दधा भावान सदा नरा गंगा तरंग रमणीय जटा कलापम गौरी निरंतर विभूषी तो वाम भाग नारायणो प्रिय मनंग मदापहार वाराणसीपुरपति भज विश्वनाथ बागीशजुष्व बदने लक्ष्मीजस च वक्षसी जस्ते हृदय संवीत निशिंगमह भजे हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे दुर्गमे में पथि में अंध स्वस्खलोत्पाद गतिर मुह शौकिपा जुष्टिदान सन्त सन्तु अवलम्बन दुर्गमे पथि में अंध स्वस्खलोत्पाद गतिर मुह शौकिपा जुष्टिदान सन्त सन्तु अवलम्बन गौरिय गोष्ठीपति शिशिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी डॉ पोपा परमंस जगतगुरु सेठ दे वैष्णवस आर आवर ओनली सपोर्ट वैष्णवस आर आवर ओनली ओडसिपल ऑब्जेक्टिव ओनली एब्सिल्यूट ओडसिपल ऑब्जेक्ट बिकॉज भगवान एंड वैष्णवस दे आर ऑल सेम तत्व वैष्णवस एंड भगवान ऑल सेम तत्व डेट्स वाई आई यूज सिंगुलर नंबर यू डोंट अंडरस्टैंड गौड़ीय गोष्ठी पोथी सुशील भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी जगत प्रभुपात परमंश जगत गुरु सेठ दे दैट परमंश गुरु वैष्णवस दे आर आवर मोस्ट और सिबू ऑब्जेक्ट इन आवर लाइफ इवन मोर देन इवन मोर देन भगवान इवन मोर और सिबू देन भगवान गुरु वैष्णव दे आर आर ओनली सपोर्ट वी आर हेल्पलेस वी इज भगवान वेर इज भगवान वेर इज भगवान कैन यू सो मी नो बडी कैन सो सो वैष्णवज आर आवर ओनली सपोर्ट वैष्णवज दे आर आवर ओनली सपोर्ट ओनली आई नेवर डिपेंड अपॉन एनी सपोर्ट you are going to depend upon money power man power educational power so many power but i don't believe because i know all useless some day they can also cheat me i i cannot keep support whenever you can believe that guru vishnavas they are all they are all only only they are only support they are only support in our life then you can start your bhajan when your mind when you are successful 
I mean by the mercy of Guru Vishnu, when you are successful to withdraw your mind from all matters, by the, by the causeless mercy of Guru Vishnu, when you are successful to withdraw your mind from all material things, by the mercy of Guru Vishnu, then you can become peaceful. Then you can become peaceful. In true sense, peaceful, we can say that peaceful is only Guru Vishnu. Nobody can say that we are peaceful. Only Guru Vaishnav they are peaceful. Because why? No material contamination there, no attraction, nothing, repulsion, nothing. Attraction, attraction and repulsion is a must in the material world. You cannot avoid it. That much power you don't have. Attraction or repulsion must be there. So, we will have to go out of the influence of this attraction and repulsion. You don't like somebody. You think enemy. Hi, he is coming. Repulsion. It's called repulsion. Oh, he is coming. Come, come, come. Because you have friendship. Like-minded people. Birds of a same feather flock together. Rajasthama prakatayo samasila vajanti voi is the nature. Bhakti Muta was speaking, people going to approve people of their own stamp. They are not going to approve you and me. They can throw you out. Ah, useless. Because you are not matching. Your mind is not matching. This is the nature of this world. But Paramahansa Gauri Vaishnava, they are not like that. You can taste them. You can think they are angry, speaking this. Not them. Not at all. Angry mean tamagun. If they are going to contaminate their tamagun, they can lose everything. All link. They can break their link with Vaikuntha Jagat. They can break their link with Vaikuntha Jagat. If at all tamagun or rajagun coming, then they cannot keep link with Bhagavan. You don't understand this point. So when you can realize that Shuddha, pure Guru Vaishnavas, they are our only support in our life. If we can take shelter of Shuddha Guru Vaishnav, then this life we can go to Vaikuntha Jagat. We need not wait for. Sila Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami Jagat Prabhupada Paramahansa Jagat Gurus said that it is the duty of Guru Vaishnava to cut your bondage. To cut your bondage, countless anartha there. Countless anarthas are there inside your heart. Pure Guru Vaishnava, they are so merciful, Prabhupada speaking. They are they are always trying to cut all anartha from your heart. They are always ready to cut anartha from your heart. They are going to help you to cut bondage and come to certain level of consciousness so that you can realize it is the nature of Guru Vaishnava. They cannot be here. Common people, they are going here and they are going to lose everything. They are not going to get any clue of their transcendental world. They are misguided. Yes. Baba speaking, it is the nature of Guru Vaishnava. They cannot feel. They, can, they cannot be here that you are misguided. Always they like to save you. They are standing with one cutter, you know, cutter, short to cut your anartha. Yes. Standing with one short cutter to cut your anartha. Like in Kali Puja, you know. Kali Puja, Durga Puja, you know. Those goats, they are being sacrificed in front of Devi. So, Sadhu Guru Vishnu standing with the car to cut your anartha. But you feel pain. Oh, leave me. I don't need Bhagavan. You leave me. You can kick Guru Vishnu and go ahead. 
is quite natural. Like ghost. If I like to if I like to find some solution of the ghost, that the more you try, the ghost become more angry. Oh, I can kill you. I challenge you. Okay, you do it. Whatever you like. Ghost doing it. Is the nature. Same thing Krishnadas Kavidas Goswami is speaking. Pishachi Paile Jyotha Moti Channa Hai Maya Baddha Jibir Hai Sei Bhavudai When ghost coming to overpower you, enter your heart, and you cannot, you can manifest one new uh, character. Follow. You are like ghost, madman, doing this and that. No. It is unusual thing. So Kishwara goes, Kavira goes, I'm going to give the same example. Pisachi paile yatha mati channa hai, maya baddha jiver hai, sei bhavud A bonded soul, you know, this is the painful condition of bonded soul. But still Guru Vaishnava always waiting with, what do you mean by Kata? Kata mean? Tata Siddhanta Prabhuchan. Kata mean not actually showed like those Kali, uh, in front of Kali Mother, they have cut. Showed mean the showed of knowledge. Showed of knowledge taking and going to cut your, all your bondage. They will like to eradicate all your bondage. Not that half portion can cut again, can that you know the tree of ignorance can grow. Not that. Very from the root. I like to eradicate and like to make you free. Because material people. It is not philosophy. You can think over and again in a lonely, alone in a room. That your bondage is like trees, all branches going down. Affinity for mind, affinity for material, samsara, affinity for something, all different roots going down. And it is going to make your, may, may, you know, fix, you know, make your rigidity underground. You cannot get free. So it is the duty of pure Guru Vaishnava to make you free from this bondage can make free. It is the nature. If somebody in the form of Guru Vaishnava, in the uniform of Guru Vaishnava, in the uniform of big acharyas, world feature, going to misguide me, not going to give me right information. Popa speaking. If somebody going to, if somebody in the form of Acharya, Guru, Vaishnava, not going to give me right information, either he like to keep me in darkness, so that I cannot grow my consciousness to discover what is the fault. In that case, Papa speaking, he is misguiding you, he is not your Guru, he is your enemy. In Upadesha I can show you the page number, you can go and see. Papa speaking, he is your enemy, not Guru. He is not Guru Vaishnava. He is going to misguide you, not going to give you right information. I like to misguide you. In that way, how we can say he is my Guru? He is not my Guru. He is going to misguide me, so he is my enemy. Pure, pure Guru Vaishnava, they are not feeling attraction for any worldly things. Anything worldly thing. They are not feeling any attraction. Because they are they are they are feeling attraction for the lotus feet of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu or Gauranga or Krishna. They are feeling. That's why material thing is useless for them. They are not feeling attraction. Whatever thing they are going to look. As a Paramahansa, they are watching everything related with Bhagavan according to the formula of Achinta Vedavetta. Baba speaking, Vaishnavas are less interested to get Asa Sangha. Previous one or two days, I wanted to clarify this point repeatedly that you will have to ensure your continuous Sasanga. Non-stop satsanga you will have to ensure. You will have to ensure your non-stop non satsanga, otherwise there is no possibility. 
Oh, Maharaj, there was uh, 15 days I went there, big sadhu came. No. No. Knowingly, unknowingly, your Asa Sangha, anyway, going to put you in bondage. Anyway, you will have to grow, you will have to go that much consciousness, so that you can find the, you can understand the fine demarcation between this is Sasanga, this is Asasanga. It seems like Sasanga. Oh, Maharaj, all Sadhu comes up. But he is Sasanga. Excuse me, I am bound to speak their naked truth. I am not speaking actually, Bhakti Muttakut told. In your daily life, you are doing so many things, but you are not aware of the fact what you are doing. You are doing something which can give you backing in your bhajan, or you are doing something wrong, or you are going backside. Bhajan means you are going forward. In your daily life, bonded soul doing something positive, at the not doing some negative. Is the nature. It is the nature of bonded soul. They in, a, in their daily bhajan life, they are doing, doing some positive thing, going ahead and doing some negative thing. So this way, positive and negative, positive and negative, positive and negative, plus, minus, after that, what is the residue? That is your net profit in your bhajan. Be careful. If you have failure to estimate this kind of thing, then I think you cannot make any progress in your life. First of all, you have to say, Oh, Maharaj, Nagar Sankirtan, there, everybody coming, I cannot go. You can go. Provided there is pure devotees. You can go and participate in Nagar Sankirtan. Provided there is pure devotees. If no pure devotees, then it is material Sankirtan. By material Sankirtan, those who are doing Sankirtan in the road, they cannot get benefit. Or those people, those who are hearing this Sankirtan, they can also not get it. It is the Siddhanta Vijayana Bhakti Muttaku. Many times I discussed in Upadesha Amritu, but you don't like. There should be pure Vaishnava. Otherwise, you can go, participate, but you can lose your bhajan. You can participate, take, at all it is not Mahaprasa. I answered many times about this all secret things. Anyway, our Gauranga Mahaprabhu, what to speak about satsanga? We are thinking how to do satsanga. And Sriman Mahaprabhu himself wanted to get satsanga. Krishna himself wanted to get satsanga. What to, what you are, you and me. He Bhagavan. Bhagavan himself, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, go, you know, Krishna, I can give you countless examples. Without Sasanga Chaitanya Mahaprabhu cannot. Without Sasanga Krishna cannot. So I need Sasanga. So Haridas Thakur is enjoying the topmost kipa of our Mahaprabhu. Because Nam and Nami. I am in the name, I am in the name Krishna and Krishna himself. If we like to draw one comparative statement, then the name is far better, I mean higher than. Rupa Krishna has already told, Bacho Bachakam Nam, this sloka you can find. More. That's why it is right Siddhanta to speak that Haridas Thakur is Namacharya. Means he is the topmost stature. He is the topmost stature. He is declared by Mahaprabhu himself. Mahaprabhu himself was declared by Mahaprabhu himself. You are Namacharya. Say so stop. Mahaprabhu liked to get the association of Haridas. Why? Haridas Thakur speaking. Please, Prabhu, don't touch me. I am no. Don't touch me. I am. Fallen soul, I am Antaja, I am no. Prabhu speaking, I must touch you. Why you know? To purify myself. Mahaprabhu speaking. In Bengali, you, you must learn Bengali, thorough Bengali. You, know. you can enjoy. Guru Maharaj used to say, if you enjoy, you can 
Translation is okay, but you can, you will have to get the direct theme. Because Chaitanya Dhamma, all language is Chaitanya Mahaprabhu himself, in the form of Sabda Brahma. A translator, okay, but still direct is more practical. You must learn, very sweet language. So Mahaprabhu speaking in Bengali. Why well, is asking? Don't touch me! I am fallen. I am Muslim. Don't, Prabhu. Ha. Prabhu speaking. Prabhu kahe, Tomas porsi pavitra hoyte. Tomar pavitra gun nahi ko amate. Prabhu speaking. Why I am going to touch you? You know, embrace you, because that kind of pure quality in you. It's not there in me. You are so pure. I like to purify myself. I like to purify myself. That's why I touch you. Embrace it. You feel sorry for that. That Haridas started. I like to speak so many things, but I have to cut short, no problem. Time. So today is the Ananta Chatudvasi, is the disappearance days of Sela. Namacha Haridas Thakur. I like to establish some point on the basis of which you can realize that what is called Tinadavi. Tinadavi is not one false philosophy. Those who have seen Sila Bhakti Pumatpuri Goswami Maharaj, Sila Bhakti Rakhak Sridhar Goswami Maharaj, they know very well what is the practical meaning of Tinadavi. They have seen. So, they think we are nothing. They are always not acting. Used to think, I am nothing. Always think I am very poor, I am helpless, I am nothing. Always think. Whole world coming to pay pranam, to get kipra from Guru Padma. But he thinks I am nothing. He is asking me. They like to take me to Vrindavan. My son, how I can go there? I told her, uh, you can go by plane. Plane is a big amount of money. I don't have any money. You search my bag. He's speaking. I was laughing. Now I have time to die, you remember, and alone I am laughing. I have that much money. Don't have you search my bag. Huh? I cannot afford plane journey. I cannot afford plane journey. He's speaking. So how much humble? Somebody going to criticize him, is speaking is actually Kanishta Bhakta. Some devotee coming and crying. Oh, Maharaj, that, that Acharya is speaking, you Kanishta. Why you are crying? I thought I have no quality. At least he is going to give me this uh, you know, Kanishta Adhikar. I thought I have no Adhikar. Yes. Why you are crying? is Kripa. So, it's impossible to speak. On those days there was no money, affluent money was not there. Hey, local, local, local train, yeah, I am also doing. That's not a big. Guru Maharaj, Prabhupada, they all used to local. One day, one wicked, very dangerous, you know, young boy, very notorious, by going to put his head on the head, uh, hand on the head of Bhakti Mahaprabhu in the train, to joke. And the Sevak was very angry. So angry. Guru said, why you become angry? Ah, he's going to... You don't think he's going to bless me. <laughs> why you became angry? He's going to bless me. So you became angry. Unnecessary. This is a, but that Bhakti 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 Maharaj, when some taxi driver going to insult Bhakti... You know, Madhav Bhakti Maharaj, if you come, like fire. Nobody has seen that Nishinga Murti. So, don't misunderstand. They have no particular, no polity, nothing. Only they like to rectify the situation. They like to see whole Gauriya Vaishnava Sama, whole, all over the world. Irrespective of different society, they like to see they are standing under the same umbrella like Lotus Feet of Prabhupada, the Prabhupada. That's why they are so strict speaking and writing. No, not out of enmity. Not that they are enmity. They can fight and cut. No. 
This is the only desire. They feel pain. That is the desire. So Haridas Thakur, one day Ma, one day Govinda, I mean the Sevak of Siman Mahaprabhu coming with Mahaprabhu. It was the rules. After Mahaprabhu taken, already taken person, that plate is going to take. Govinda speaking, Thak, Govinda, you come and take prasadam. Oh, you bring prasadam? But today I cannot take prasadam. Because my Sankhanam is not complete. So you bring prasadam, I have to honor prasadam. So let me honor. Honor prasadam and take one particle. Today I cannot take because my Harinam is not complete. Mahaprabhu coming one day, it was a rose. Every day Mahaprabhu going to Jagannath Mandir, morning time, Arati, while coming back, whatever thing, whatever thing Panda they were giving, Tulsi Mala or any Uchishta Prasadam, so many. Are taking Prasadam Mahaprabhu and coming fast, fast coming to meet with Haridas. It was the rules. Mahaprabhu fast going to Haridas to meet with him, after that giving some prasadam, everything, after that Mahaprabhu go to some other place. It was the rule, from the very beginning. It was the commitment of Siman Mahaprabhu. Mahaprabhu coming, Haridas, how you? How you are? I am okay. But my, my, you know, my mind and body, everything sick. Haridas kahe mor asusto buddhi bon. My sickness is there in my mind, brain, everything. What kind of sickness? I cannot complete my Harinam so easily. Why you are going to uh, you know, pay so much attention? Because you are Siddha Mahatma. So why not you do less Harinam? Mahapu is thinking, why you are? We are going to pay so much attention. Ah, now you are Siddha Mahatma, Namacharya, you can do less Harinam. Haridas cannot do. Without three lakh Harinam, Namacharya Haridas cannot take, drink even water. That kind of strict restriction you can see. One Siddhanta which are in between, I like to put, never mind. Namacharya, this title, we can speak to Gokishar Baba, we can speak to Raghunath Das Gosai, we can speak to Bhakti Thakur, we can speak to Prabhupada, we can speak to Bhakti Pumaturi Goshima, never mind, try to catch the Siddhanta. Because without being Namacharya, nobody can act as Acharya, you don't understand. Without being Namacharya, nobody can act as Acharya. They must have a full attention in Harinam, Nambajan. That doesn't mean everybody can take this title Namacharya. Everybody can? Don't understand my point. Try to understand. Then all fighting over. I have no jealousy with anybody. I can promise and touch. I have no jealousy. Only and only Namacharya Haridas Thakur was given Namacharya. None of Gauriya Parshat or Gauriya Parsha never wanted to take this title. Even somebody who no, it was totally reserved for Namachaj. Same thing about Prabhupada. Nothing, no, no question of fighting. This title was trouble. This is the thing. But if people misunderstand this, very painful. Anyway, this Siddhanta in between, I speak you. Haridas Thakur speaking, my Harinam is not complete, that's why I cannot take prasadam. Mahaprabhu, in front of Mahaprabhu, he is speaking, my mind and body, my body is okay, my inner you know, mind and inner you know, intellect all sick. That's why. Then Mahaprabhu suggesting you can do less Harinam, less Harinam. But Haridas Thakur cannot. Finally, Haridas Thakur speaking to Mahaprabhu Prabhu, 
I think you are going to disappear from this the material world. Prabhu, I think you are going to disappear from this material world. So please you, you don't show me this Leela. You don't show me this Leela. I don't like to see this Leela. I think you are surely going to disappear from this material world. You will have to bestow keep on me so that I can go much before than you. Much before than you are going. You please bless me. Then Mahaprabhu was speaking. How you can speak this? How you can speak this? Because all my Leela, all my Ananda, Sankirtana, all with you. Especially you are Namacharya. By your mercy, everybody knowing the glories of Harinam. How you can say this way? This way you, sh you cannot speak. Because without you, how I can stay? Then Namacharya Aridas Thakur speaking, well, don't speak this way. Don't speak this way. Because you have countless devotees in infinity world. You have countless devotees. I am one insect. One insect going to die. What is the profit and loss account? Mother Prithibi can draw. Our mother Prithibi can draw any profit and loss account? Even insects going to die? Nobody. I am like that. Mohana Kit Jodi Murigala. Pipilika. And I can be compared with one very small insect or like ant. If one ant going to die, what is the profit and loss account uh, Mother Prithivi can draw? But the one ant is lost. So I am like that. So please don't. Please don't speak like that. You promise me, you can do it. Mahaprabhu speaking, well, what you are going to demand? Mane, all your desire Krishna surely can fulfill. All your desire all of your desire, surely Krishna can fulfill. Krishna can fulfill all your desire. So also. Haridas Thakur speaking, I like to go away from you. I like to go away from this world, I mean, but before you. I don't like to see your disappearance, Leela. Mahaprabhu approve it. Next day, Mahaprabhu coming from Jagannath Mandir, by that time so many devotees, so many devotees coming with Mahaprabhu to visit Haridas. And Mahaprabhu discovered Haridas lying, half lying, half sitting, half lying, and doing Harina. After that, Mahaprabhu started Sankirtan with all devotees, Nam Sankirtan, great Nam Sankirtan, enthusiastic way. Harinam Sankirtan, Mahaprabhu started dancing and singing. Then in the meantime, Haridas Thakur prayed to Bhagavan, Please you come to me. Please you come to me. Then Mahaprabhu coming in front of Haridas, and Haridas Thakur requesting him to sit in front of me. After sitting, Haridas Thakur watching the lotus mouth of Mahaprabhu without any twinkling. Fix and taking the lotus feet of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu on chest. You see, on chest. And always speaking, See Krishna Chaitanya, See Krishna Chaitanya, See Krishna Chaitanya. Repeatedly speaking. In the meantime, with the name See Krishna Chaitanya, going to leave the body. Leave the body. All devotees bursted into tears. Mahaprabhu also, tears rolling, ah, like Ganga water, all around. Mahaprabhu crying and taking the body of Haridas Thakur in the lap and started dancing with the body. You, should, you see the love of Bhagavan for devotee. If we criticize devotee, how Bhagavan can excuse us? 
This is my request to you all. Vaishnava Parat, Bhagavan never liked to excuse. Any other opera Bhagavan can consider. Vaishnava. Vaishnavas are the heart of Bhagavan. That's why Mahaprabhu taking in the lap the body of Haridas Thakur and dancing. After that, all devotees taking Haridas Thakur in a you know, hand bearing, hand be you know, hand bearing, you know, bed. They are taking Haridas Thakur up to up to ocean, and there Mahaprabhu himself going to. And you know, arrange the bathing of the body of Haridas Thakur. And speaking to the ocean, today you become the topmost pilgrimage in the world. Mahatirtha Hela. Mahapur speaking to the ocean. E Samudra, today you become the great pilgrimage. Unparalleled, unbeaten. Everybody taking the water wash of the lotus feet of Haridas Thakur, drinking while, while Mahaprabhu arranging bath, you know. Then all devotees taking and drinking water. Finally, Mahaprabhu took them. It is the place is just near Shargadwar in Puri. They are taking a suitable place where Mahaprabhu make one big cavity. After they put the body, transcendental body of Haridas Chakur, and after that, Mahaprabhu was the first. Mahaprabhu was the first to take sand and put on the body of Haridas Chakur. He was the first. After that, all devotees they giving sand on the body of Haridas Chakur, making a big wall foundation, so that in future somebody can make one temple. Samadhi Mandir, Mapu well ever, that in future, near future, somebody can make Samadhi Mandir of Haridas Chakra. Finally, what happens? Mapu is going to make one tomb, you know, like Chura. All devotees are crying and singing, dancing, big, enthusiastic way. Mahaprabhu glorifying Haridas Chakur like one man having hundred face. If one man having hundred face, and in hundred each of these hundred face going to speak about the glories of Mahaprabhu was like that. Mahaprabhu glorifying Haridas Thakur in hundred like hundred face. Haridas Thakur is the Namacharya. By his mercy, now you know we can know the extreme absolute glory of Harinam Prabhu. He is the Namacharya. Continuously Mahaprabhu speaking the glories of say Haridas Chakur, finally going to check himself because we'll have to arrange one festival, no? One festival we to arrange. Finally going to Jagannath Mandir to bake Prasadam with his cloth in front of Panda, those who are selling Mahaprasadam. <coughs> you give me Mahaprasadam, I like to arrange one big bandara. I like to arrange one big bandara. So you give me prasadam bhikkhya. The all in you know, a panda, they are going to give you everything. Oh, you take everything. Then Swarupa is like, no, 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 no. Prabhu, you go. You go. You go, please. Then Swarupa is like, arrange so many prasadam. Anyway, giving so many prasadam. After that big amount of, huge amount of prasadam. Swarupa is like, bring with five people. Five devotees, they are taking all prasadam and reach and Mahaprabhu going to arrange big festival. Mahaprabhu going to arrange. I, I can receive prasadam. Mahaprabhu taking big, big pot and giving prasadam. One, one devotee, Mahaprabhu give. Five people cannot take. Mahaprabhu give. This, this. Mahaprabhu hand is so big. Taking this society. Nobody can take. Because Prabhu giving, okay, Saru was saying, you are unnecessarily giving, you are giving, nobody can take, you see. 
any because first of all you will have to take na nobody can take so better you sit i can with five people five devotees shankar adi i can gopinath all like we can distribute you sit please then mahaprabhu was bound to sit and in between giving big jay dhani jay haridas thakur ki jay namachaj haridas in between they are taking mahaprasadam in between big jaykar after that mahaprabhu going to give chandan and garland to all devotees come come give me chandan in body and giving garland sakshat parat pora khileshwar bhagwan sri krishna chaitanya after that mahapu going to declare the tiruvat tithi you know observed by all devotees mahapu speaking those who are coming with the body of prakita sarir body of haridas thakur and the kirtan those who are coming in the sea for the bathing of haridas body of prakita those who are going to give some sand in the samadhi of haridas thakur even those who are dancing and singing in the sankirtan of haridas procession of your prakita body even those who are going to take prasadam done nothing only prasad they all need not come back again in this material world they are confirmation ticket to get krishna mahapu told confirmation mahapu giving stamp ticket confirm surely mahapu speaking surely they can get krishna surely they can get krishna this is the glorification of namacharya haridas thakur if we go on speaking about namacharya haridas thakur it is endless it is endless we cannot say. one or two incident i can speak after that i will switch on switch over to other issue our our other you know nijantiti of sila bhakti vigyan bhakti gusti maharaj haridas thakur you try to understand all siddhanto like mathematics why i told why i told if there is aprakita shabda brahma if there is sankirtan in sankirtan if there aprakita sadhu then and only then outside people can get benefit otherwise not this is the example i can give haridas thakur is namacharya chanting hari naam 1 lakh hari naam very slowly one lakh hari naam up pronouncing not so loudly and another one lakh is loudly follow now you know the case of benapol benapol bengal bangladesh border where haridas thakur first started doing bhajan after coming crossing uh, that time it was india totally india it is not border na no? it was india that one. total undivided india so that time that time what that time what happened haridas thakur started doing bhajan you know the case of ramchand khan the idiot number 1 who committed offense unto lotus feet of haridas thakur by sending one very beautiful frost to prove in front of public that haridas thakur is characterless follow so consecutively consecutively for the three nights he is going there to arrange the meeting i mean the association of haridas but he was face he was failure first day going paying pranam to tulasi sitting in front of haridas and speaking you are young very nice stout figure i like to get your association well haridas one yes of course you can get my help but you will have to wait but because na sankha nam my you know nam complete till then you will have to wait that nam was not completed nam is time is over then in the morning time again that cross gone again second day coming again same thing my name is not every day you speak in this what to do my naam is but i see next day okay next day you can come that day haridas thakur doing hari naam 
and that pros consecutively for three days hearing Harinam, that Harinam coming out, Aprakita Harinam from the lotus mouth of Haridas Chakra. By hearing this, all the anartha inside the heart of that pros, stalwart, all gone. All gone. A heart become pure. This is the reaction of transcendental Harina. This is the reaction of a Prakita Harina, a Prakita reaction. So after that, what happened? That pros, pay pra, you know, fall down in front of Haridas and going to uh, disclose all the secrecy, conspiracy. Finally, Haridas was speaking. Well, I know everything. That is why to save you. I know everything, all in details. But to save you, only to save you, I was keeping patience. Because I know by hearing Harina, you can change. After that, she is crying. After that, taking shelter onto the lotus feet of Haridas Chakur. You know? So, this way, one cross, very, very dangerous character. She was rectified. So, this is the nature. Haridas Chakur could go away. Haridas Chakur could go away. Haridas Chakur could go away from that place, no? very easily, but not going. Haridas Chakur is beginning to save you. I am waiting for three days. This is the. Also, you know, when Maya Devi, Durga, Maya Devi came to take Harinam from Haridas Chakur, she started playing different games. But she was failure. Ultimately, she received Harinam from Haridas Thakur. It was in Santipur. It was there in Santipur, Fulia, Fulia, at the bank of Ganga. I went there one time in my life, 25 years back. Fulia, Santipur. That 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 cave is there. Inside that cave, there was big snack, poisonous snack. Anybody coming to pay Dandavat to Haridas Chakur was, we cannot say yes, so much burning. We cannot say yes. Burning? Well, I am not feeling any burning. Or we don't know burning we are feeling. Something there, some poisonous snack, snack. I don't think, I don't see any snack here. After that, all people coming and paying, yeah, feeling this way. They cannot come and stay. Then Haridas Chakur praying to that, you know, that snack. If you are there inside this cave, either you can stay, I can go away, or you can stay, I can go away. I can go away, or I can, I can stay, you can go away. Both, because all devotees, they are feeling pain. Those devotees, they are feeling pain, they cannot come to uh, give kippa to me. Haridas Chakur speaking. Uh, they are coming to give keep out to me. I cannot say. Uh, they cannot come. So either you can stay or I can stay. Both cannot stay. Then in the meantime, evening time, Haridas Chakur doing Harinam and watching one big snack coming. Oh my God. Haridas Chakur doing Harinam. A big snack coming out. Of, because the prayer, you cannot believe. The prayer of a divine devotee, the prayer of a divine devotee, the prayer of a pure devotee, even one snack, tiger, elephant can understand. I can give so many examples. Not one example. Our Rasikananda Prabhu speaking to that mad elephant, crazy totally. Hey, you are, how long you can do express your craziness? Come, up. Come and see it. Ah, the elephant come. Ah, coming and going to sit in front of Namach, in front of Rasikananda Prabhu. Rasikananda Prabhu giving Harinam in his ear. And from then onward, he was converted. That elephant was converted into a great devotee. In his name was Gopal Das. Rest of his life, yes, rest of his life, he has done great seva, massive seva. Big bandara are going to take big, big tree, dry tree. Who can stop elephant? <laughs> going to different shop and taking all the wheat bag, everything and going to play. <laughs> Do bandara, open bandara. 
So this was up to the last moment of <coughs> last moment of life. So it is not miracle. Guru Padma used to say to me, My son, if you really love Bhagavan, if you really love Guru Vishnu, even you have no enemy with any creature in the world. Guru Mahaj used to say. But practically you can prove if you are uh, in this situation. Even poisonous snack, if you go, if you give your leg on the, on the body of poisonous snack, see, see, Guru Mahaj used to say, still that snack cannot bite you. Guru Mahaj confirmed me. If you have no enmity, then because Paramatma, Bhagavan is also sitting inside the heart of the snake and tiger. That is why tiger cannot attack Jagannatha Bhavaji Maharaj. That is why tiger cannot attack, you know, Balabhadra, Balabhadra Bhattacharya who is going behind Mahaprabhu. Tiger is there in the forest. Oh, tiger! But not attack. Because Mahaprabhu is there, no? So tiger. And it is confirmed in Bhagavatam that if Krishna is present there or Krishna Chaitanya Mahap, same thing, present there, itself there one environment is created, that is called Vrindavan. It is written, confirmed in Bhagavatam. If Krishna is there, Chaitanya Mahap is there, if Madhavandha Puripad is there, if our Jagannatha is there, automatically Vrindavan appears. And what is the nature of Vrindavan? It is written. Vrindavane naishargi ki durvaira shahasano ni migadayo. It is confirmed in Bhagavatam. It is the nature of Vrindavan. There, tiger, elephant, deer, they are playing with each other. Not. I have seen myself. One monkey and one calf playing with each other. <laughs> I have seen one small calf, monkey catching. Ah. Our was playing, this playing. So it's the nature. So it is written in Bhagavatam, Bindavane Naishargi Kidirvaira, there is no enmity. Shahasano ni Migadayo. Deep Siddhanta Vishara. Because they are Aprakito there. So anyway, the great Haridas Sakur is Thiravaptiti. It's impossible for us to be here. We cannot be here, it's separation. Mahaprabhu himself speaking. You try to remember the last remark of Simon Mahaprabhu. You to try to remark, remember the last remark of Simon Mahaprabhu. Mahaprabhu crying and speaking. Krishna is very merciful. So by his mercy, I got the association of Haridas. But the desire of Krishna is not, not under anybody's control. So I miss the association. Kipakuri Krishna Diachilo Shango Bengali. Kipakuri Krishna Diachilo Shango. Shatanta Krishna Icha Hoilo Shango Bhango. Mahapu himself speaking. Is out of causeless mercy. Krishna arranged my, associ my association with Haridas Thakur. But the desire of Krishna is beyond our control. So, Kishno Kipakuri Diya Chalya Mare Sangho Satantra Kishne Richa Hoilo Sangho Bhango That Sangho we miss. And Mahapu going to pass remark that Haridas Thakur gone mean the, the topmost jewel of this earth gone. Mahapu speaking. The topmost jewel on this earth gone. Prithibi, Prithibi Ma, I mean Arth Ma, Prithibi Ma, crying. She is crying. There is a remark. Today also we will have to cry because we are going to lose one, another jewel of Saraswat Gauriya Samaj. Yes. Yes. We are going to lose another star in the sky of Gauriya Samaj. Jewel. Up to now, I have not seen any body whom I can compare with Sila Bhaktivedanta Bharati. Up to now, nobody. 
it is his highness that he wanted to give his association to me i have no right to speak he used to love me i have no right to speak this way he is one kind of audacity i used to love me why i am a monkey he used to love me why what quality is there in me it is his highness that he wanted to give his association all the time i am bound to confess today what you are watching me any position very infinite is small position that is all for them all for those guru vishnu i have nothing to do i am protected because they are protecting me i am protected fully because they are protecting me they gone from your eyesight but they are protecting me. i can feel it all the time i cannot compare our bhakti vigyan bharti maharaj my shiksha guru with anybody i have not seen such a personality he was itself one kind of encyclopedia of gauri history if anything you ask to bhakti vigyan bharti maharaj he can speak immediately he was one kind of encyclopedia miracle miracle how is possible 40 years back he saw somebody is coming to meet him old age now maharaj you can remember yes i saw you in chandigarh 40 years back are mira ka can remember he can remember follow all gauriya samaj sarasvat gauriya samaj i mean that present time they used to come in front of sila bhakti vigyan bharti maharaj for consulting anything anything suppose some difficulty some problem how to solve not only god brothers even guru varga miracle not only god brothers you cannot say oh they are the god brothers god brothers of bharti maharaj not that even guru varga they also sometimes what to do there is a problem eh? bharti maharaj in front of bharti maharaj exceptional intuition exceptional personality who was the only personality in our saraswat gauri mat to solve all problem flawlessly very nice he used to be. very nice and the most important thing what i must speak that is the exclusive guru vishnu seva mood of sela bhakti vigyan bhat he repeatedly told us maharaj people think i am a great learned man i have gone through ved vedanta bhrin no i am not learned even in my previous life not so education because i came na in the year of 1955 in the year of 1955 bharti maharaj practical i mean personally join but previously he used to come he used to come and serve and go away uh, in the year of 1955 he joined totally completely batima told many time maharaj everybody think i am a great learned man but they don't know this kind of capacity coming of siddhant everything by those the great association of great great devotees right from the beginning martima speaking it was a miracles my guru maharaj always used to engage me in vaishnav seva or in you uh, know different kind of important seva like construction seva or organizing big procession nam sange or organizing a gaur mandal parikrama bhaj mandal parikrama it was the nature because this kind of patience is rare this kind of patience which was visible in sila bhakti vigyan bharti maharaj eh hey, sila bhakti vedanta bhamanga se maharaj rare rare impossible endless that's why bhakti vidya madhugo sima used to say 
that Narottam of Brahmachari is the idealism, topmost idealism in Brahmachari society. In whole Brahmachari society all over the world, we can safely say, in the whole Brahmachari society or, or in the Sanya society, it was the topmost idealism of that's why Madhu Goswami used to say, Narutama Brahmachari and his idealism is a unique idealism. So much patience. That's why he was given title that you are the only personality who can do unalloyed seva, who can do tireless seva. Bengali you don't understand. So I can see also Bengali. Klantihin Seva, you don't understand. So I have to convert it. You don't understand. In Bengali, Klantihin, Mane, tiredless Seva, flawless Seva. Madhu Goswami wanted to give on behalf of you know, Sama Assembly. That he is able to do tireless Seva of Guru Vishnu. He is the only person to whom we can see extreme alertness. I promise you, I am sitting in Vyasasana. Bhartima is not giving me some bribe so that I can... Bhartima is not giving me some bribe so that I can speak for him. Really I say, so much alertness, I have never seen. Bhartima is present any place, anywhere, any temple, any assembly, anywhere. Look around. Understand. What is there, what is there, everything can understand. One or two examples I can speak about is alertness, you can go mad. You cannot realize. So what kind of alertness pure Guru Vaishnava having? Without having this kind of alertness, extreme alertness, how they are going to represent one after another Siddhanta? One after because they have extreme alertness. Guru Vaishnava naturally. Guru Vaishnava naturally they have extreme alertness. They have eyes everywhere. You can see only here and there. But Guru Bhajan have eyes everywhere, all around. They can see everything. But you cannot believe, I think. A practical example I know. I have seen in the life of Guru Varga. And Bharti Maharaj, I never say he is my God Bhada. Never I say. Bharti Maharaj, Bhakti Vala, Tritu, they are my Guru. I never think, I never call them God Bhada in my life. But our Bhakti, Vedanta, Vaman was never. They are my Guru. I learned so many things. So many things from them. How I can ignore? I am not a traitor. That I can, I can ignore. No, nothing. I cannot. When I am going to ignore their Kipa, then I can fall down. Those who want to prove their own supremacy, I am the great. Bhakti Mita right. Those who want to prove their own supremacy, only and only they try to open one new field. Bhakti Mita writing. I can show you. Upadesham, I can show you. You open the book. Bhakti Mita speaking only those who like to collect some stool and urine. Stool and urine I am using. I mean Pratishta. Same thing Prabhupada told. Kanaka Kamini, Pratishta Bhagini, all. Or prati, you know, a stool and urine proper told. Anyway, so Bhakti Mantra used to say, only and only those who want to collect some name, name, same position, only and only they like to ignore our Guru Varga, Guru Parampara, and they like to start one new. Bhakti Muta is I am not speaking. And Bhakti Muta is speaking, confirm that they are going to live Sauta Pantha. Someday I can explain full Harikatha about Sauta Pantha. Because you can express some doubt, I know. Someday I can speak Harikatha on this only Sauta Pantha, from different angle. Then you can realize I am Bhakti Muta right. Bhakti Muta confirm. Our way is Sauta Pantha. Sauta Pantha can never be a new road, new way. 
So Tobanda sang all Guru Varga Khan. Those who want to prove that we are successful to open one new pantha, Bhakti Thakur speaking that new way, pathway established by them, that path, and who is going to establish the Acharya and his followers, they all can go in vain. Very useless. They can get a sting. All become useless. Bhakti Vindu confirm. I can show you. Very shortly, maybe for 50 years, maximum 40 years, 50 years, 60 years after that thing. That pathway, because new generation coming. You know the nature of new generation? New generation, they like to ask so many questions to you. You will have to give perfect answer. If you give wrong answer, they can catch you. But you are a cheater. New generation, very sensitive. Countless questions they put. Someday they can discover new generation. I confirm it right now. Maybe that time I will not be here on this earth. Some days are coming after 50, another 50 years or 40 years, 50 years, 60 years, 70 years. Then new generation can come and can realize that our previous acharyas whom we are following, he spoke all wrong. All wrong. False Siddhanta. Even, I don't know what they can, even they can break the Samadhi. Because in near future they can become so ferocious. In near future our new generation becomes so ferocious. If they are going to find some flaw, fault, some duplicity, they can attack. I know. So many such examples I can give you. Practical example. Okay. You think I am going to speak something wrong. No. Practically. Who took Muslim Dharma first? Took Muslim Dharma, Saudi Arab. His birthplace was broken and making a multi you know, hotel. Five-star, not ten-star hotel. Broken. They are breaking. Because they are they, they realize day by day all their philosophy, all false. It is going to provoke people. So, it is the latest news. I am not new, reading newspaper. It is the latest news I got. So, it is the must. Because they could realize all false. They are wrong. It is written wrong here. Calculation all in their sastra. They are going to ignore. Day by day, situation will arrive. When people become more and more interested to know the f actual Siddhanta Vichara, or they can realize those are, they wanted to cheat us, they never wanted to speak us the right information, then they can become angry. So, anyway, Srila Bhakti Vigyan Bharati Maharaj is one kind of star in our Saraswati Goryama. He was given this title, Extreme Patience, Endless Patience, Endless Patience, Non-Stop Seva Mood. All these titles were given only and only to Bhakti Vigyan Bharati Maharaj. He was given, right from the beginning. If I go on speaking only about Bharati Maharaj, well, only about Bharati Maharaj, you go on speaking. <laughs> month after month you can go. From different angles. All is Siddhanta which are everything. Endless. So I feel lucky. To get the association. I feel proud. Bharati Maharaj repeatedly used to say, Maharaj, big, big, Sadhu association. I mean, all big, big sadhu, their association is my property. What all property today you feel, you find inside me, all the properties I collected from our Guru, our big, big sadhus. It was the nature of Bhakti Deva Madhu Goswami Maharaj. Even if some sadhu, he used to play one trick politics, went already against you to kill you, to drive you away from temple. See, still it was the nature of Bhakti Vita Maharaj to serve him. 
But you are speaking. That I asked Guru Maharaj. Maharaj, he was a man. He was a man who arranged our who arranged our you know arranged our going away. Who arranged our going away from Chaitanya Mahat. You ask me to serve him? Yes, you have to serve him. You have to serve him. Even enemy. If I go on speaking in details, you can go, how possible? You cannot believe. If I go on speaking, you cannot believe. Litigation about that the Abhirva place of Prabhupada. Srila Bhakti Vita Madhu Goswami are trying. What wrong in it? Bhakti Vita Madhu Goswami are praying with folded hand, requesting everybody, you all my God brothers, you are Vaishnavas, you can help me. I alone cannot do it. He already requested. But finally, what happens? Some, one, so I don't like to speak because enmity is not my target. He filed one case again, Bhakti with Madhu Goswami. Madhu our Bhakti and Bhakti are speaking. So that we cannot procure that place. He wanted to prove all evidence that we are the only authentic Mahat Chaitanya Mahat. So they are not duplicate. The Madhu Goswami was feeling disturbance, but still keeping patience. If it is a desire of Prabhupada, I can get. By chance, all the evidence was there, submitted in the court, and stay order was supposed to be published. In the just previous day, all the transaction, I mean the place was procured. What is the area? Miracle. Of Prabhupada. Just one day before. I mean, if you if you wait, if you wait 18 hours, 18, not 20, 24. Tomorrow, court can publish stay order, stay order or purchasing, you cannot buy. You see, how Bhagavan is going to help Guru Vishnu? How Guru Vishnu getting help from divine help? So, Srila Bhakti Vigyan Bharati Maharaj was such a personality who is having direct knowledge about actual Guru Vaishnava Seva. Sometimes we think we can give some money to Gurudev. Sometimes we think we can give a lot of money to Gurudev. Gurudev becomes very happy. We think so. We have a wrong conception. We have no idea about Guru Vaishnava. We only hear Harikatha. We cannot go deep into, we cannot go beyond any particular. Harikatha is beyond any particular, no particular. We think sometimes, oh, if I can put so, so much energy and uh, I can collect so much, Guru they become very, very happy. Not that. To satisfy Guru Vaishnava, you will have to realize the heart of pure Guru Vaishnava. To realize the to satisfy pure Guru Vaishnava, you will have to realize the heart of that was the capacity of Bhakti Bhagavan Bharati Maharaj. Many of us can claim we have done seva, this seva. Seva you have done. Seva means the more you can do seva, you can grow humbleness, no? It's the nature of seva, no? You have done in seva. Any seva you do, you can grow more and more. I have done nothing. It is a nature. I, you, even you can open Sandarva, I can show you. The more you can do seva, I have done nothing. I am useless, I have done nothing. After doing seva, I am the only man, I am doing seva. What is this? What is this? Huh? I am the only man, the preacher. Eh? What is this? In the first hand, you are disqualified. In the first hand report, you are disqualified. The more you do seva, you can say, no, I have done nothing. But useless I am. This is the nature of seva. Then, then Bhakti Vigyan Bharati Maharaj was a, such a personality who was always successful to satisfy Guru Vaishnava. If I go on explaining one one point, I mean the darshanic vichar of Bhakti Vigyan Bharati Maharaj, I can go. On speaking. One one incident I can speak. 
One one incident, single. One one single incident. You can go mad. So fine IQ. I am about alertness, what to speak. So many Siddhanta. Day by day I can speak surely. One day, in Nanda Gaon, all devotees going there. On Nanda Gaon. I mean, Brajmandal Parikrama. At the key of the room of Guru Padma was there with Bharti Maharaj. He was given sannyas by the way, I should speak, because time is limited, I am very sorry. In the year of 1969, he took sannyas. His name was Bhakti Vigyan Bharati Maharaj. Bhakti Vigyan Bharati Maharaj. So, by that time, he was already sannyas. So, the key of the room of Gurudev, I mean Bhakti Vita Madhugusi was there with him. In the meantime, without taking the key from, from Bharti Maharaj, Madhu Goswami is gone. Because function is over, but Bharti Maharaj, uh, he needs to stay more, because to solve all problems, then he can go. He can meet payment of guest house, and their car fare, everything, all the day, pandal, all. After that, he can maybe three, four hours after. But Gurudev is gone. With one toto. Ah, gone, Gurudev. After immediately, eh? Gurudev gone with a key. How I can? If I go away all scattered, who can solve this problem? He immediately called one toto man. You know the place? You know that you are. You know the place where we, uh, my Guru Maharaj, you know, at present going halt there? You know? I know. Immediately take some money and go. Run. Very fast. 100 kilometers per hour. Go. Immediately, that Toto man, Brajavasi, he is taking money. Oh, Maharaj, no problem, I can solve the problem. Running. Money taking, no, poor man, <laughs> money. <laughs> Running. Even Madhukusi Maharaj, reaching that place, he is supposed to wash his hand and leg and think, I forget the key to take from Narottama. How I can? Okay, I can stay outside. No. In the meantime, one diver coming. Maharaj, your key given by your Bharti Maharaj. Madhav Goswami Maharaj done. So much alertness. So much alertness you see. Regarding your publication, speaking Harikatha, speaking Siddhanta, anything. So alertness should be there. So super alertness. You can find inside Guru Vaishnava. Patience, if I speak, go on speaking about only patience, only one quality, quality patience, I can go on speaking. Bharti Maharaj. That is why my Guru Padma told, after I go away from this material world, you will have to consult Bharti Maharaj. Any problem you meet, so the case. Whenever I used to write in for any protest now, it was by the approval of Bharti Maharaj. Bhatiman never touch any single point. Never cut. Oh, you have written wrong. Never. <laughs> it is a mercy. Never. Hey, reading and dancing. Oh, nice. I bless. No problem. You publish it. Nobody can do it. It is truth. It is a fact. Now people thinking wrong way. Bhatiman used to say, whenever I am going to represent some fact, I am not speaking lie. Then that kind of fact, representation of fact, cannot be treated as criticism. Because I like to represent the fact. Bharatami used to say, I can show you writing. If some sadhu is going to represent the fact, not going to analyze fact, then it is not criticism. Criticism means your manipulation, some angry attitude, some, some jealousy, that's, that is wrong. I like to give another example where I have to stop because another engagement immediately I can cross and run. Accounts I will do. Follow. Go Sala Seva. Going on. So, you see, in um, Srila Bhakti Vita Madhugu Maharaj, after Prabhupada, he used to arrange function in where? Where is a Kumbha Mela? Elahabad Kumbha. So many incidents, I can quote one incident. All devotees coming because Madhukusi Maharaj means heart is open. 
Madhukusi Maharaj's heart is so extended that he can grasp the whole world, a calm. But still, some people are going to criticize him. It's very painful. Madhukusi never wanted to fight with anybody. But still, anyway, so all devotees coming, all God, Brother, the, that, any mod, oh, all allowed. Ah, you stay, stay, no problem. Any mod, anywhere. Oh, you stay. In the meantime, our Bhakti Vichar, Jajavar Goswami suddenly took decision to go to Kumbhamal with one devotee, Seva. Like, no, no, pre, no pre-information was there. So, place all occupied. So now, they receive one letter from Jajavar I am coming tomorrow uh, to attend. Uh, then everybody feeling upset. Ah, where no place is there, all captured. Where he okay, can say he is always making late this that, and Bhartamaraj came to know why he was so anxiety. Hey, actually, uh, Jadavarma writing later he is coming tomorrow. Who can give place? Why he was so anxiety? Don't worry, Vaishnava is coming. A great fortune. Vaishnava is coming. Here. We should be very happy. We should dance. I can give my place. You keep your place. No problem. I can give my place. My place is there. As a manager of the savana, a special place, I can give to Ma. He's coming, Bharatima speak, sitting, sleeping outside. Open place. If I go on speaking about the patience and the mood of seva, unique. When I, if I get hundred pests, I cannot complete. So nice glorification of Bharatima. Today we are helpless. Without Srila Bhakti and Bharatima, many times I wanted to compile one book, special book, uh, all the writings of Guru Maharaj. I wanted to segregate Samanda Vidya Prajan. So I was uh, reading each and, each, each and every article and thinking I can discuss with Bharati Maharaj. Uh, should I give this uh, in the category of Samanda category or Bharati Maharaj? You can give all title to me. I already wrote. About the speaking can better if you can give this title in the category of Ovidya. Are you okay, Maharaj? I am very lucky. So experience. Where is such a where is such experience, Sadhu? Today we are crying. I am tearing my head. I am tearing my here. So we like to get this kind of sadhu who can very nice. Whenever I come in front of Bharati Maharaj, I feel satisfied. Ah, oh, now it's okay. No problem. Where we can go? Where we can go? To seek help, where we can go? Now he is there already. We cannot see invisible, but he is there. So, I, still if I pray under his lotus, he is, surely he can respond. Otherwise, how I can able to solve all problems? Whole world almost gone against me. Because I am speaking about that. Oh, without any reason. I can prove I am not your enemy. I am not your enemy. I am not your enemy. But still they cannot be. He is speaking this way. So it must be not enemy. Anyway, I have to establish Siddhanta. No? So anyway, by those mercy of Allah, Guru Bhargava and Shiksha Guru Bhargava, I am now enjoying protection anyway. So I cannot misuse it. I promise them. Till my last date, I like to utilize my Shakti they are giving to me. I can utilize proper way. They bless me. I like to do Vajam Jai, Sisi, Sila Namacha Jaridas, Takur ki Jai, Tadiyo, Nirjan, Titipara, Mahamasab ki Jai, Jai, Sila Bhakti Vigyan, Bhartakushi, Maharaj ki Jai, Tadiyo, Nirjan, Titipara, Mahamasab ki Jai, Gaur Pemanande, Hari Hari Bhur. No, no time actually. So, so you bring the prasadam, you keep. Durga me pati me andhashas khalat pader pader gatur muhu kipa sa kipa justi dane no shantaha shantu avalammanam bancha kalpatrasya kipas. Patitanu pavana prasadam. I mean, Goshala, there is some seva going on. 
So I have to pay there, night time, no time. Come, come in front. Ah, come in front of me. Hey, you come in front of me. Take prasadam. Ah. It is the prasadam of Bharti Maharaj. Be careful. Jai Bharti Maharaj, you can speak and take. Eh? Ah, this ma. For after a long time you are coming. <laughs> oh, well, this. Take prasadam. Money is the topmost dirty thing. Why? Money going, going everywhere. I have seen those are cutting meat with blood and they are touching money. Yes, yes. That's why I never touch money. Sometimes I am bound to touch because I will have to pay to labor. But usually 